could be very interesting what that is here happening right now. Some volcanic activity. Is that oil? Who knows? Whatever that is, it's scaring the hell out of me. I hope it's not happening in one of my bases. But it looks, it certainly looks beautiful though. I like that one. I don't know why it happens. Perhaps because we have reached um, a milestone or something in the Mars terraforming process. So temperature is coming to 100% soon, the same with water and the atmosphere. The problem is the vegetation now. So vegetation is stuck at 40% almost. And the only way how we can increase that now is with the special projects. So those forestation plants, they have not much use anymore. At the moment, I'm going to use them now to, you know, plant trees and stuff like that. Other than that, mm, not much use in them anymore. Let's have mixed trees here. I don't know why I've used the normal trees there. Mixed trees seems to be the better option. Overall, cost a bit more. Yeah. But hopefully it looks better too. So let's just use those mixed trees everywhere now. So we have some trees here and there. So, but they're not going to increase the vegetation rate anymore. That is something of the past, unfortunately. So we only depend on those... Missions now. Oops, I've got two grasses here. Let's take the bush. Perfect. So we have some grass here too. And right, that's the only way how we can improve that. So for now, we're starting to for the trees. And what I also wanted to do now is the, well, you name it, outpost. We want to build an outpost somewhere here on Mars. Uh, we got lots of resources down here where I'm deep scanning all the time. As we can see, we got some rare metals here. Oh, there is another... Anomaly that we can scan. And I would like to build an outpost somewhere. We don't... Well, we need more concrete actually. And also a bit more metal. Since those resources are kind of rare. Getting rare in my area. And water would be nice as well to get up a larger lakes up there. It's still here. It's still happening. I don't know why. So let's find something with water. There's lots of water here. That looks interesting, so we could build large lakes or something like that. Here we have water and metal. Do we have water, metal and concrete close by? Anyway, over here. There. Perfect. That's what I was looking for. So we got those three. Isn't that too far away? No, it doesn't look like it. We could even get them in one dome there if we wanted to. Okay, so how are we doing this? I want to have an outpost here. It's a bit further away from my colony. But the first thing, I think at least, I didn't quite read it up now, so we're going to try this out. I think it's the commander with the drones on board. We got four drones on board there. Um, another thing I want to do here is having some depots that we can build. So I'm going to have some depots here in the middle. Oh, wait a second. Just wait a second. Oh, the salvaging also needs to wait again. No, it, it's gone now. I don't want the underground metal since that requires a workforce. So we're just looking for water and concrete. That is way better because both of them don't need any workers at all. And this one looks good. It's even an average source here. Yeah. So let's have an outpost down here. Perfect. That's it. Let's send the commander. So I've got the commander, this one here. I'm going to send this one here over to that peninsula or whatever that is the valley down here and i want to get i think we need to start with a depot here oh and of course we have toxic pools so the drone commander will need to take care of that and first of all let's set that drone commander over to this drone commander and try to kind of repair it so it needs i hope it needs a, it's waiting for repair so i hope it needs another drone and that drone commander is going over there now and hopefully doing its magic or something like that. And right, we also have another rocket here as far as I can see. It is waiting for the required payload for the next special project. We do lack a bit of fuel there right now. That might be something we need to get in order here. The uh, fuel production that we have there. So everything has been amplified. There consuming some water we do have so much water so let's just have another fuel refinery and i think it is here somewhere there it is 
And I know this base looks a bit chaotic, but again, this is my first playthrough and I was just learning as we progressed. I'm definitely ho going to have a second season of this game, so a second playthrough with some other missions. Um, and then I know how to properly build a base, you know, making it a bit more beautiful and, well, professional looking. Because theoretically, engineers are creating all of this, so it should be looking a bit better than that. Right, there we have the fuel refineries. For some reasons, they're not getting any energy here. So let's connect them to the cable. Oh, and I just learned that we can actually have those cables below the pipelines. That's also another nice thing that we could have here. That looks just way better. And save some space there too. And also, let's amplify and upgrade those refineries so they produce even more fuel. Very nice. Good. Um, the rockets are all on a way to special projects. Unfortunately, we have another seed project now. And I would, I would really like to do them as soon as I see them. Right now, we can't do that. So we need to wait for one of the rockets to come back. It was because of the greenish yellow hue of the beryl crystals. Okay, normally analyze. The contrast with the red Martian dust made them appear almost alien. Even if they wouldn't make any of the colonies superhuman, they would surely give us almost supernatural powers and reduces the cost of physics tax by 10%. That was the explorer, right? Yeah. Going for those anomalies. We got quite a few of them here on Mars. Over there is another one. There's also one, but we can't reach that. So let's go for this one there. Scan anomaly. Okay, and where's my commander? He's reaching that one now. Research complete. Perfect, and they're actually repairing it. Very good. Now we have two drone commanders again at our disposal. And... Right, let's get them... Let's get them down here. I want to build that outpost there. So both of them are on the way now. Oops, and yeah. That drone commander, those, both of them I think. Yeah, didn't load their drones with them now. Recall drones and recall drones. That's the way. And let's get those strong commanders down here, so we can start with the outpost. That rocket has soon finished that one, and why is this one not launching yet? Missing some fuel. Let's cancel. Let's cancel that expedition and do the seed expedition. And we're just waiting for that while we enjoy that beautiful music in the background. And Vigor 7 is going for that project. There is... The, we need to well, use some of those seeds. We have way too many of them. And the open farm is full as well. So that's that. And we definitely want to get that vegetation up there as quickly as possible. Otherwise, we don't have a terraformed Mars. The rest is pretty close soon. We also captured another ice asteroid. So we are at 85 water now. And since we're producing, I think, quite a bit of water there, I mean, it's say zero because the stored water is full, but I think we're quite high there. We could also get another lake up. I like those lakes. Let's have a huge lake somewhere over here. We have some space here. Unfortunately, that huge lake is too big. I mean, we could theoretically... Can we transport? No, that would need water. Let's have a smaller then. Because I need that space here for the domes. Let's have a smaller lake here somewhere. Too far from a working drone commander. Oh, it, that's difficult. Where can I have another lake? No space here. That looks good. There we can have some... There we can have a lake. There's pipes close by and also some drones. And let's connect it with another pipe here too. And they're already delivering some machine parts, some concrete. 
shouldn't take too long. Bit more concrete here, and then we can already go for that. And all extractors continue to extract small amounts when their deposit is depleted. A new breakthrough. That's interesting. So we don't need to re um, demolish them anymore. And that lake is finished now, and it consumes, of course, some water here. Three water. It still says zero because, you know, it's still full. And getting us some more water now into the atmosphere in that lake here. And there's coming the water. Okay. Let's see where my drone commanders are. They should have arrived down there. Nope. But they're close. And let's get that rocket here down. Coming back from a special project from the water. This one's still being loaded with the seeds. The more I play this game, the more I like it. Everything comes together. You know, it takes a bit of a time before that happens, but when it happens, it's a good feeling. And just look at Mars. A new special project. This one takes a bit of resources, but gives me 1.5 billion money. Perhaps we do that. And there's a huge mountain there. A volcano. Yeah, let's do that special mission there. 1.5 billion, that's quite a lot of money. And we have the resources for that. Let's do that. And I still want to get that outpost up and running. So, my drone command has arrived. Let's start with that. First of all, we need a... I think we need... Yeah, well, first of all, I need to clean the mess up here. So deploy the drones. And they should start now cleaning that toxic pool. This is taking longer than expected. But they're doing that rather quickly. And that's a huge toxic pool here. We got lots of them actually. And I think we need to re to get rid of them. All of them to increase the vegetation. Next rocket launches. All three rockets are now landed. Sector scanned. And being refueled and their cargo being loaded. So the next one is Avril 1. Let's see what new we have. New thing we could do here. Not many projects left anymore. This one gives quite a lot of temperature, but we don't really need that anymore. Where's the other one? There. No. That's not worth it. Let's see if we can do something for research. Resources. Resources. Money. Let's do the money thing there. Doesn't cost that much either. So two money missions and one for the vegetation. Okay, the cleaning is over soon. Got lots of waste rock here now too. And there it's been cleaned. Now we can use, now finally we can build those depots. So I want to build two of those depots here. And they're using the metal close by to build that. So we don't even need the shuttles for that. And right, I don't know what to do now. Oh, there are the shuttles coming, look at that. And they're already delivering some goods here. And we can just get some, I think we can just now have a water extractor here. Oh right, the water extractor needs a pipe though then. That would be a very, very long pipe, but it's possible, I think. We have a ramp here. We could have another ramp here. Let's have a ramp here too, yeah. So we have a, another terraform landscaping project with the ramp going from... Huge ramp that we have there. But this is going to work. And doesn't even take that long. So they can do that and then we can have the water extractor here. And we can also have the concrete extractor. Just need to find that one now. Haven't used it in quite a while. There it is. And then we can already have an outpost just like that. And the shuttles are then... Just normally, you know, delivering the goods then from point to point. 
they're doing the heavy lifting. I could also have a dome down here then and the people could just transport there via the shuttles. Perhaps we're going to do that as well. Perfect, the ramp is finished. So what I'm going to do now, I'm going to have the pipe. Going all the way up here. into that dome here and then it's connected and we also do the same thing with the power cable going down here Sector scanned. too far from a working drone commander i'm going to solve that too soon and right in here perfect that's working. So this one's working already, producing some concrete there. And the pipes are still being finished. This one, uh, yep, they need the drone commander there. So let's get those drones in and drive up here. And that's the way how we can use resources from somewhere else. And could gradually build up a bigger colony. Oh yeah, those need metal. Those pipes. That's interesting now. How can I do that? I do have the shuttles, so they should deliver something at some point. Okay, that's a bit unintuitive. To, to say the least, I don't know how to do that right now. The shuttles should deliver something. There's a shuttle coming, but it's not doing anything. It's just getting some resources there. That's it. No other shuttle is coming. They're not delivering anything here. Why did this work though? This one's been completed here. This one's just the, the one. That's a bit strange. Right, it lacks the drones. No, it lacks the metal. So perhaps they're delivering that at some point. Or I should have a depot here. Which is not possible because of uneven terrain. Okay, so this is a bit strange now. How the hell am I getting that metal over there? For the pipes. I don't see any other way since we can't get the metal there. So how am I supposed to get water from down here up there? Is it supposed to be that difficult? Well, we'll have to find a solution at some other time then. I don't want to focus too much on that right now. We do have some other buildings, so we do have enough resources. We, have, we can build now the Omega Telescope. Another wonder and the artificial sun. I'm looking forward to that. Let's build the artificial sun. This marvel of Martian engineering produces colossal amounts of power. It provides light for nearby solar panels during the night in addition to heating the surrounding area. Consumes vast amount of water on startup. And that's going to be our artificial sun. Just a question now where we should put that. I think here, right? We do have some space here. And everyone can see it then from here. So there it's being built, the artificial sun. Going to take quite a while, but we do have the resources, but, but it's going to take a while to transport all of that over there then. And now we have some better special projects again as well. And there we have the special sun soon. So all the energy problems will be gone with that as well. And we have a beautiful landmark then. Because I think this building looks quite nice when it's activated. And I also want to have that Omega Telescope.
I don't know how big the building that the capital city is going to be once it's complete. We'll have to wait for that a bit. I really don't know how big it's going to be. Okay, we do have the concrete extractor here, but still the water we can't use. That is lame. People, how am I how can I do that here? That is just very, very strange. We do have shuttles, they should deliver the, those goods. But they're not doing that. Although those pipes you have been built for some reasons, you know? I don't know why. Because there's there was no drone commander here. Perhaps I do have to get rid of that once again. And build it again. Nope, still not working. Well, it's raining too heavily. I don't see anything anymore anyway. There's someone delivering something. Yeah, that this one's delivering the metal to this point here, but... Yeah, at least that's being built here. So this part is still missing here with some metal. I think I will need to have a drone commander... Here somewhere. That one will be able to transport the goods up to this point, but not to this point here then. And we can't build that metal depot here on uneven terrain. Oh boy. At least the artificial sun is being built. The resources have been delivered. The odd thing is we're still pretty full on everything, so we can build with we can go ahead with the telescope then right away. And coming up, artificial sun, it still needs a pipe. Oh look at that, it's trying to build it, but not yet. It needs 100 water for startup. We do have enough water. It needs a thousand water for startup. Okay, we do have that as well. Okay, there the water is being delivered now. And this dome doesn't have enough water because of that. Well, it has to, to, to survive with that for now. It's going to be over soon. Yeah, we, we definitely have enough water there in store. So it's being built now, the sun, kind of. That's pretty cool. 700 out of 1000. Sector scanned. And get ready for it. And here we have the artificial sun. It's actually a sun. In that one here. And right, resources are low, it doesn't matter, we produce enough water again. And we produce a thousand energy because of that one here now. Because of that sun. Really, really cool. The next monument, the next wonder would be the Omega Telescope. So that is something I would like to have also somewhere here. Yeah, let's have the Geoscope Dome down here, and then I can have the Omega, Omega Telescope right beside it. So here. Mm, 
No, again, I want to wait on that a bit. But we can build the, the telescope. I really want to build the telescope somewhere. So over here, perhaps. Yeah. Let's have it here. I will also need some power cable there. There's already one. Perfect. So needs again lots of metal, concrete. We have that. Lots of electronics. We do have them too. Fortunately for us. And oh, all three rockets are back now from their projects. Let's land all of them. There they are. And let's start with the next mission. So right away we do have another seed mission. Very good. That will push us over 50% vegetation. And this one, Ice Asteroid, will push us over 90% for the water. And one more. Again, we would have the rainfall. I think we go for the rainfall. Or this one here. Yeah, let's go for this one here. More atmosphere and heat pushes us even closer to that. Perfect. So we got three terraforming projects now with the rockets there as well. And I think, yeah, we should be building that one now. Perfect. Resources are being delivered. We just have to wait now a bit for the Omega Telescope Wonder. That should also enable us with a few more breakthroughs. That we can then use. And what's being researched there? Terraforming Amplification. Meteor defense system, that's also pretty good, even though we're not getting any meteors anymore, so let's get rid of that again. Martian network will boost the research output. And perhaps we finally go for the tourists there as well. Or the Dream Reality Wonder Project Morpheus stimulates the development of new perks in adult colonies throughout the entire colony. Yeah, let's go with that. And a new wonder there as well. And that's it for now. I think it was a pretty cool episode. We have now the artificial sun. We have a small outpost, even though the outpost is not quite working yet. Since we need that last piece of pipe here, we need the metal there somehow. I was hoping the shuttles would transport that over here, but they don't. So we need to see how that that's going to work. And at least we do have now here the concrete extractor working. And producing some concrete there for us. And we could also do that here. So we have enough concrete here. The shuttles are at least getting those resources from that outpost. Other than that, we just wait for the telescope now. And then we can soon start also with the big domes. Once we have the terraforming parameters up here at 100%. Temperature is coming up first. And then the atmosphere. Going to look forward to that. Stay tuned.